This is After Egypt in Action, episode 13, and I'm your host, Terry Davis. So, um, they've been talking about immigration on the radio. God, God said, uh, God's against immigration because it causes slavery, and because he likes giving birthrights. Um, there's a story of Jacob and Esau. And uh, God, one guy gave up his birthright, and God was hated hated him. God uh, likes giving birthrights. God likes giving gifts. God's favorite saint is Santa. Anyway, God said oil. Um, I asked God what he thought of uh, Arab and Jews. He said oil funny, hopefully. Oil funny, hopefully. Anyway, uh <clears throat> So, uh, Jesus uh, said, I am um, meek and humble of heart. What does humble of head mean? Humble of head means you don't think you're smart. So, humble of heart means you look at other people and you don't think you care. Judas betrayed Jesus because um, Jesus had expensive perfume poured on him. Anyway, so... uh, did you know it was 300 days wages? That's like $30,000 worth of perfume. And Judas was angry. So proud of heart means you won't take a gift from God. You don't You don't like being American. You don't like being... God made you an intellectual. You don't have to labor. Don't, don't feel bad. That's a gift from God. They, they have their own benefits. Anyway... Uh, don't feel you should you should be thankful for your gifts from God. Don't don't throw them away. Um, anyway, so uh, uh, they're talking about immigration on the radio, and God said it causes slavery, and also He likes giving birthrights. And uh, uh, what else? Um, Hold items, <clears throat> announce, persecutes, perish, flashing, uncorruptible, price, got, threatens, placed, attack, giveth, ought, oughtest, wealthy, allegory. Hold items, announce, persecutes, per- There's a church on the radio near the border. Flashing, uncorruptible, price, got, threatens. Uncorruptible price. I think he's talking about immigration causing slavery. Um, flashing uncorruptible price. Maybe he's talking about after Egypt price. No, he got threatens. Place. I think he's talking about tariffs. Got threatens. I don't know. Placed. Attack giveth artist. Wealthy uh, giveth thought as well. That's not very clear. Oh, that's a bummer. I did all that work and God didn't give a very good answer. <clears throat> anyway, um, so uh, uh, what else? Uh, how about uh, Oh, there was a volcano in Japan. That's pretty normal. Were you trying to say anything with the volcano? It killed 31 people. House. As the word went out of the king's mouth, they covered Haman's face. And Harban, uh, one of the chamberlains, said before the king, Behold also the gallows fifty cubits high, which Haman had made for Mordecai, who spoke in good for the king, standeth in the house of Haman. Then the king said, Hang him thereon. So they hanged Haman on the gallows that he had prepared for Mordecai. Then was the king's wrath pacified. On that day did the king Ahasuerus 
give the house of Haman, the Jew's enemy, into, unto Esther, the queen. And Mordecai came before the king, for Esther had told what he was unto her. <coughs> the, what, and the king took off his ring, which he had taken from Haman, gave it to Mordecai and Esther, set Mordecai over the house of Haman, and Esther spake yet again before the king fell down at his. Uh, is this immigration? Some, you know, uh, People expect me to be in favor of immigration. You know, I, I I was generally in favor of immigration, but then God said, you don't have to be. And then it's like, well, yeah, that's what I really want. I don't want immigration. Immigration is like, do I have to? You do it because you think it's the right thing to do. But if God says, no, it's it, it causes slavery and um, he likes giving birthrights. Well, if will twist my arm. <laughs> oh, forget it. We don't want immigration. Anyway, um, 